Hi, I'm Majid Khan. I am a Director of Spine Intervention Radiology at Johns Hopkins. I did this minimally invasive spine augmentation procedure by placing vertebral implant to raise height in a moderately to severely compressed vertebral body. This implant really makes a difference in patients who have moderate to severe compression fractures, in which your primary goal, of course, is pain palliation, but the second most important goal is height restoration. So this is uh, image guided. Everything is done through one needle, what we call as the axis cannula. We put that in and everything goes through that axis cannula. So that's why only one puncture. This is the stent and there are two side holes in the central bar and that's where the cement comes out and fills up the central portion of the implant and anchors the implant within the vertebra. With the implant what is different is that we are leaving the implant in the vertebral body and just putting bone cement to anchor that implant within the vertebra. This patient population where height restoration becomes a major issue, I think this is the best device to use in such patients. Only few places offer this treatment all over the country and Hopkins is one of the premier sites for this.